Classic Book Review, Number 20. Cicero's, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum. Cicero's, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum, is a remarkable philosophical treatise that delves into the nature of good and evil, examining different ethical theories and seeking to define the ultimate purpose of human life. This book, written by one of the most influential figures in the history of philosophy, not only presents a thought-provoking exploration of moral philosophy but also offers insight into the life and ideas of Marcus Tullius Cicero himself. Marcus Tullius Cicero, 106-43 BCE, was a Roman philosopher, statesman, lawyer, and orator. Born in Arpinum, Italy, Cicero rose to prominence during the late Roman Republic and became one of the most celebrated orators of his time. He played a significant role in Roman politics, defending the republican principles and advocating for the preservation of the Roman Republic against the encroachment of tyranny. Cicero's writings span various genres, including speeches, letters, and philosophical treatises, showcasing his versatile intellect and eloquence. In, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum, On the Ends of Good and Evil, Cicero engages in a series of dialogues, presenting the viewpoints of three philosophical schools, Epicureanism, Stoicism, and Academic Skepticism. Through these dialogues, Cicero provides a comprehensive examination of ethical theories, aiming to uncover the ultimate source of human happiness and the nature of the good life. Here are some important quotes that highlight key aspects of his argument. On the nature of pleasure and happiness. Pleasure is the ultimate goal that we all seek the standard by which we judge every good thing in life. On the Stoic notion of virtue. Virtue alone is sufficient for happiness. It is the highest good that can be achieved. On the Epicurean pursuit of pleasure. Pleasure should be pursued as long as it does not lead to pain or harm to oneself or others. On the limitations of knowledge. We must acknowledge the limitations of human knowledge and embrace the uncertainty inherent in our understanding of the world. On the role of reason and wisdom. Reason should guide our actions, and wisdom lies in recognizing and following the natural laws that govern the universe. On the value of friendship. Friendship is essential for a happy life, providing support, companionship, and mutual affection. Cicero's, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum, is a testament to his intellectual rigor and his ability to engage with diverse philosophical perspectives. His work not only sheds light on the ethical theories of his time but also showcases his own philosophical synthesis, drawing upon the strengths of various schools of thought. In sum, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum is a captivating philosophical work that showcases Cicero's intellectual prowess and his significant role in the history of philosophy. His works, including, De Finibus Bonorum A e Malorum, helped bridge the philosophical traditions of Greece and Rome, blending elements of Stoicism, Epicureanism, and academic skepticism into a unique Roman philosophical synthesis. Indeed, this book offers readers a profound exploration of ethical theories while providing valuable insights into the life. 
Thanks for watching. More classic book reviews are on the way. May the wisdom be with you till then.